Hi, YouTube. I just shoved like a whole bag of goldfish in my mouth. Anyway. You know what pisses me off? <laughs> Wait, let me tell a story. No. <laughs> Telemarketer. Telemarketer. Oh, did they hang up? Oh, they must have. Dang it. A, te a telemarketer who's clearly calling me from India. <laughs> With the I Indian. I don't care if you're from India, Ireland, Mexico, America. I love you all the same. But don't try to pass it off like you're calling me from Illinois. You're not calling me from Illinois. They might be immigrant. No, there's no <laughs> way. They're probably just patching in through a panel through there and then calling us. Anyway, so this guy calls and says, like, I'm not going to use the accent because it's going to sound super racist. <laughs> but they call and say, like, do you own this domain? And then they say the domain. And I'm like, I, I don't know what you're saying. I couldn't understand you. <laughs> and they think to themselves, oh, I'll say it correctly this time. And they don't. <laughs> He does that several times and then he spells it out. First of all, here, here's the bad thing. You know, you're trying to call me from another country and I can't understand what you're saying. I'm sorry, that's on you. But then you're a telemarketer trying to call me because I registered a domain. You're not gonna get my business. I'll seek you out if I want that. So what I do normally when I get those phone calls, I say, hey, can you hold on a second? And then I put them on mute and then I leave the phone there. And I don't- How long did he stay on? Let's see. Hold the call time. was one minute long, so he's probably on hold for 30 seconds. That's not very long. But still. Dude, call me. It pisses me off. Where are we going? Oh, yeah. You're going the wrong way by our house. Anyway, a rant from Trevor. Don't call me, you stupid marketer people. <laughs> and I tell you don't call me, and you still call me. <laughs> okay, that's nice. Hi, right, bye. Trevor's gonna kill us. And I'm eating all the goldfish. Sponsor! Not really. I'm so hungry. We met with um, a builder today. We met with two builders because we told you that we're building a house. We met with the second builder that we've seen so far. And they seem nice. I didn't. I I wanted to see more of their houses and talk to them. Now we have to have a second meeting with them to look at houses that they're building right now. Cause they only have one model home that I did not like at all. I didn't like a single thing in it. So, I don't know. But they say they can do whatever we want. The other builder that we saw, um, I really like pretty much all the houses that I've seen that they've built so far. But they showed us more houses. So, anyways, this is boring for you guys probably. <sighs> it's a long, drawn out process, and we're going to drag you guys along the whole way. Drag you along, kicking and screaming. Sorry. Um, two days ago was my parents' 37th anniversary. Wedding anniversary. My dad texted me yesterday and he's like, how old are you? And, or not yesterday, the day before. Anyways, I was like, uh, I'm 27. Because I have to think about it. Because in my head, I'm like 24. I don't feel my age. Anyways. So I told him I was 27. He's like, Today's me and your mom's anniversary. We've been married for 37 years. It's kind of crazy. That's a long time. You forgot your parents' anniversary, Megan? I don't know what day it is most of the time, Trevor. So, we're cheap and we aren't getting gifts or anything. We're taking them out to dinner. Yeah. I don't really think they want anything, though, so... Maybe we can buy my dad, like, a bottle of rum. <laughs> you know, actually... Didn't we, for one of their anniversaries, we were talking about making them grandchildren? We were, we were okay, late. we were taking them to dinner, and we were late, and my dad was kind of being a butt about it a little bit. Because we are habitually late to everything. Yeah, we are. Just expect it, honestly. Nowadays, just expect us to be late. Because it just happens. Anyways. And so, we like, joked that we were making their grandchildren. We weren't really, we were just late, but... <laughs> but like, he was like speechless. He yeah, like, he not was Not speechless, like, but just like, be nice or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> it was pretty funny. He, Cause my dad normally has like, something to say back. Maybe he'll watch this. Anyways, this is long enough.
Although you'll edit it, right? Yeah, this is weird because it usually comes when you go home. And we don't have this we house don't anymore. own anything over here anymore. Should we drive by it? We've never showed our address on here before, have we? No. We probably still won't, but... We need to get a P.O. box. Yeah, I guess so. Why is... Why are you cut out of the... I'm not. Yeah, you are. Do you see half your face? Part of your face is out of it. See right here? My ear. You see how much of me you're showing? There you is go. Is that better? <sighs> I'll cut you out of it. What is my makeup doing? I'll just fix my makeup in the vlog. I need to charge my camera to vlog. Anyways. Yeah, I need to figure out where I put mine. I know I just had it the other day. 